there's this thing, in Final Cut called Storyline Mode. Apparently there is some confusion as to what this actually is. If you look in the commands dialog and search for Storyline, you'll find Toggle Storyline Mode at the very end of the list. The shortcut for this is the G key, and the command detail is, Toggle the ability to build storylines when dragging clips in the timeline. Okay, a little vague, so let's take a look. I have two connected clips here, Fire and Ice. If I try to drag one clip to be adjacent to the other, without holding down the N key for snapping or if snapping is off, you'll see the other clip just tries to move out of the way. If we try dragging a clip in from the event browser, it's basically the same thing, except, if you cross the boundary with the event clip, you will see a film strip icon appear. Releasing the clip would pop up a menu requesting how you want to replace the connected clip. Now, if I hold down the G key, while still dragging the event clip, and move it close to the connected clip, you will notice Final Cut creates a secondary storyline, indicated by the dark gray bar over the connected clip. And, if you look closely, you will notice a blue rectangle appear under the clip you are moving. When you release the clip, it will be added to the secondary storyline just created. The same is true for dragging other connected clips you may want to join in a secondary storyline. Holding down the G key and dragging the clip close to another, watch for the blue rectangle, and release to add. That, is storyline mode. Thank you for watching. Please visit fcpxtemplates.com for over 180 products for your post-production needs.